In this section, we'll build a classical style column using polygon editing and subdivision surfaces. We'll start with a cube. This one's about two feet square. We'll scale it in the Z axis using the controls on the bounding box until it's about five feet tall. Now we're going to point edit mode, sweep the top face and draw the column up to its full height of about 15 feet. At this point we want to scale the top face of the column in X and Y until it's about 1.7 feet square. Switching to a front view you can now see that the column has a tapered shape characteristic of the classical style. Now it's time to add the capital which is formed from a series of sweeps. One technique I use which makes this sort of work a little easier. After scaling a face in X and Y, come out of sweep mode by clicking on the point edit faces tool. Then return to sweep mode. This ensures that the new swept face is precisely the same size as the previous one and so saves us from having to rescale the new face, as would be the case if we'd stayed in sweep mode the whole time. You do, however, lose the sweep path so you can't store it in the library. As we go along, it is necessary to add extra floors to the sweep. These help keep the shape of the capital crisp as the diameter changes. Without them, we'd just get a lumpy effect when we switched on subdivision surfaces. An extra floor is added before and after each time the diameter changes. and now we're just approaching the top of the capital. When the capital is complete, one more floor is added to the top to ensure that the final diameter is right. And so that's it. Looking at it though, it's clear the proportions aren't quite right. It's too tall. To fix this, we switch to a front view and use the rectangular selection tool to select the edges, ensuring the back side option is on. Now we can scale those edges. Disabling scaling in X ensures the diameter of the column is preserved. And finally switching on subdivision surfaces mode gives us our final column. The base of the column is formed in exactly the same way as the capital.